everyone welcome back to my channel welcome back to one more video about my hair so today's video is about my hair before and after i blow dry it so this is my hair before i blow dry it and i'm gonna explain to you guys what i do before i blow dry my hair <music> So before I blow dry my hair, what I do, which is extremely important, is I apply heat protector to my hair because I don't want to have heat damage. I had this mistake in the past and uh, it was horrible. I had to cut my hair. So basically, like I said, before, uh, after I wash my hair, I just apply heat protector and then I divide my hair in small parts. So let's say I divide my hair in 10 uh, little parts and then I start uh, blow drying my hair. First, I, sa I start on a medium setting for my blow dryer and then I'll just go to the high setting according to how my hair is being, you know, uh, straighten if it's not straightening proper uh, properly then i'll put it on a higher setting but if it's straight in normal i just leave it on the medium and basically what i do uh, uh while i'm uh, blow dry my hair i make sure that i don't pass the you know the blow dry as many times so most of the times i do it like four or five times and that's it that's enough for me so i don't overdo it because i don't i really want to i want to avoid heat damage because i had this issue in the past and i don't want it to repeat again and yeah my hair of course you can see here <laughs> the huge difference because um, the shrinkage for my hair is a serious, you know, it needs to be studied for my hair because basically my hair looks so short and then when I blow dry it, it looks like, you know, very long. And yeah, uh, I also add, after I finish blow drying my hair, I make sure I add leave-in conditioner. Uh, but before leave-in conditioner, I add my oil. If you guys want to know the recipe for my oil, please comment below because I'll show you guys how I make it. So basically what I do, I just add peppermint oil, argan oil, avocado oil, and I also add castor oil and tea tree oil. Then I mix them together and this is the oil mixture that I've been using for my hair. And basically this is what been helping my hair to be, you know, to stay healthy and stay strong. So every time I blow dry my hair, I realize that my hair is getting longer and longer. And then I can real I, I also realize that my hair is getting, you know, very healthy. So this, this is the mixture that I use. I also make sure while I'm adding the mixture to my scalp and to the end of my hair that I actually massage my scalp because this is essential that a lot of people always advise when we apply certain oils like peppermint oil because they help with blood circulation and then they also promote hair growth so what i do i make sure i massage my hair sometimes i put my head <laughs> down just for the blood to flu flow you know down so then i can massage my hair very like very easy i do that for three to four minutes and then afterwards when i finish i just add my leave-in conditioner because adding leave-in conditioner would uh prevent breakage because of course our hair would get dry especially now that we are in the summer here where i live in spain so my hair gets you know it's too hot so i need to give extra moisture to my hair so i use um leave-in conditioner and sometimes I, if i'm wearing braids i just spray my hair with water and then i'll just go outside because it's too hot to just walk like this and we need to protect our hair from the sun as well this
this is all I do after I finish blow, um, blow drying my hair. I add my oil, uh, oil mixture. Then I add leave-in conditioner because I want to protect my hair. And yeah, and then afterwards, because I will leave my hair out for like, I don't know, two or three hours because I want to appreciate my hair. And then afterwards, I just, uh, you know, I just make two big corn rolls and I just go to sleep but before i go to sleep of course i use a head scarf or just a bonnet because i needed to sleep i don't want to mess up my hair and then yeah this is how my hair looks and i you know guys i always say that but i i love my hair i really really love my hair and i appreciate my hair so much because the actually uh, sometimes i neglect my hair but i can see that my hair grows really really good and yeah thank you guys so much again for watching this video and i hope to see you guys again